Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're uh, finally bla back playing, finally black, oh gosh. Finally back, back playing some BTD6. Um, I'm going to be showcasing a different mod. It's, a, it's um, I wouldn't say it's exactly a roguelike mod, but it's, I wouldn't, I would also say it's pretty similar to what you would kind of get from like a roguelike type game. Um, but yeah, so the mod itself is called Ancient Monkey. Uh, you can find it on GitHub. That's where I found it. And, um, and yeah, so you buy, you get this monkey, which is the Ancient Monkey. Um, you get different weapons and you can make the weapon stronger. You can buy abilities for it. The, the weapon can obviously range from um attacks from heroes to just you know normal attacks like you know the sniper or oh, 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 okay that's not what we're doing but yeah the sniper you get large caliber faster firing or attack shooter you know you could have up to overdrive attack zone so you could get tier five um upgrades and uh attacks just on this one guy you could get like freaking you could get like dark champion or legend of the night or something like that like the the attack of the legend of the night now obviously you wouldn't get the ability but you you'd, you'd still get the attack from it i hope i hope i under, i did a good job at explaining that now let's just get into it and maybe hopefully as we go along things will kind of make start making more sense so yeah, let's just get uh, Gwendolyn's attack here. Um, so yeah, these the beginning part is going to be pretty difficult, I would say. I mean, not difficult, but it's not going to be quite as crazy as it as it can get later on in the game. Um, one thing I did notice that um, at least with the heroes, I'm not sure if it is with every tower, but at least with the heroes. Um, it just adds the hero like if i'll show it here um sada oh wait i guess maybe it's not doing it but uh for like big heroes like sai or i assume probably pat fussy as well and churchill um it just puts the hero on top of the tower so like you can still click on it but like it, you'll just also see like the uh the uh whatever thing the uh uh the overlay from the hero a uh, sprite you'll see that as well on top of the, the tower but yeah um this is gonna be a pretty fun mod um i'm actually really excited for this there's also this button here which you can pay seventy five thousand dollars to turn this into an advanced ancient monkey so you unlock a new rarity increase new weapon slot by one Increase stronger weapon slot by one. Increase new ability slot by one. Greatly increase luck. Remove common rarity. Stronger weapon and new weapon cost increased. A uh, new ability cost decreased, and you keep everything. So yeah, I think we're gonna save up for an ability because there's a pretty good abilities so we can get. Spike storm. There we go. I'm also gonna allow myself to uh, use the tech bots. Because I don't want to have to use the ability each and every single time. Um, so yeah. Uh, at, from this point on, I think we're just going to be having this go. See, there we go. We got Overdrive. Overdrive, not going to be that good unless things get really close. So maybe like for like when Moab show up or something like that. Something that we're really going to need to... Okay, so, the Sada attack can hit camos. That's one thing. The tower itself cannot technically hit... Um, hit... Camos. And I... Like I said, I think how this works is that it may just put the tower... On top... Of the existing, you know, ancient monkey. I could be wrong. Um... But, but yeah, so like the, the attack itself has to be able to hit, um, 
camos or leads or, you know, anything like that. DDTs are going to be a pretty big issue. But, you know, obviously that's later on, but they, they would be a pretty big issue um, to deal with. Simply because you need something that hits both leads and camo. Obviously, right now, we only have the Sada ability, or the Sada attack, and that's the only thing that we have that can actually hit camos, unless you include the uh, Spike Storm as well on that. Um, let's get Shuriken, so we have a little bit, we have something else that can hit camos. Stronger weapon will be really good um, for later on. Obviously, you can see, oh yeah, $500, why wouldn't you want to buy that? Well, obviously the price increases every time you buy it, and it only buffs your current uh, weapons. So, later on, you know, your weapons and stuff that you get later on are not going to be affected by this stronger weapon upgrade. See, like it says, make your current weapon stronger. So, you, the current weapons that you have active, uh, that you have bought, those are the weapons that get buffed. Uh... Future weapons do are not affected. So you want to save it, save this upgrade until like, I would say like until you really need it, until you get to a point where you're like, okay, I'm kind of getting overwhelmed. That's when I would pull that one out. Ooh, overclock. Overclock's gonna be insanely good for this. Just imagine this guy constantly being overclocked. Oh yeah, we need a the actual overclock on him so yeah now everything's going to be stronger because he's getting this overclock ability uh, does that have full uptime it seems like it has even more than just full uptime like this is he's, he's got like permanent overclock okay let's try to get okay let's get another sada I guess so if anything gets close to him, like, it's not getting past. Uh, the Psy ability, will, or Psy weapon, is going to be good. Just literally just grabs a balloon and stops it permanently. Um, so that'll be pretty good. But yeah, see, that's what I mean. Like, it, it seems like it just puts the Psy, like, tower or sprite over over at the ancient monkey um let's get cluster cluster bomb so yeah at least we have some um you know the sada attacks so we can you know actually deal with camos we're doing pretty well so far um might want to save up for another ability maybe kind of what i'm thinking of doing but we'll have to see Hopefully this goes well. Um, snowstorm. Okay. Um, something that I also realized is that you have to keep re um, resetting the tech bot every time you get a new ability. Um, because for whatever reason, you know, any any new abilities don't get like used um, if you don't do that. So. Just to play it safe, I'm going to do that. Um, spike balls. Oh. Okay. Okay, we're barely surviving. Camos are still a very big problem. So... I mean, I guess let's try to... Try to... Uh, uh, we're going to need to get something that's going to help deal with the camo problem. Um, you can get um, MIB as an ability. So I might try to get that. At least I believe you can. Um, I just remember hearing that you can. I haven't actually... Yep, see, there we go. Now we have... I was just talking about it. <laughs> that's exactly what we needed. Um... So yeah, so now we have permanent, you know, camo, um, camo, whatever, camo detection, that's what it's called. <laughs> um, so now, yeah, now all of our 
weapons can hit camos rather than just a few. So now we don't need to focus as much on camo popping. I should have put this guy like more here so then he would have been able to hit more of the lanes. It's fine. Things are still going well. I mean, now that we don't really have to worry about camos and we can just focus on actually like popping balloons, I think we'll be in a better position now. We could get some pretty good abilities as well. Just not sure if we want to keep spending money on our abilities. Like, because we'd have to obviously be saving up quite a bit of money if we wanted to keep going for abilities and it could just end up going very badly but at the same time it could also go end up going very well because you could get something like the monkey economics thing which gives you like ten thousand dollars every time you use the ability so you could get something really 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 strong like that and i think we're gonna have to hold on, hold on. oh stronger range oh here's boost well, this is just way better Probably one more. Oh, money boost? Uh, I guess if anything gives me money. Why is this considered epic? When it is worse. Go with that. Okay. Bouncing bullet. Okay. I'll take it. I do like how the stronger weapon thing looks, though. It's a lot different than what I remember seeing it as when I watched like videos of people play this uh, mod before. Um. So yeah, there's definitely a lot of changes from, like I said, from the last time I've seen people play this so i'm pretty happy to kind of see some new things and get to try it out because it is a very 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 fun mod and it's completely you know rng you get something really good one one time and then get something terrible another time um like i was watching 2d play this mod and he was just getting common after common after common, or like, you know, or like he'd get like a, a rare here and there, but see, monkeynomics, that's exactly what we needed. So, a free $10,000 every time that ability gets used now. Um, but yeah, he was just getting super unlucky and then, you know, watching the uh, tuber, where it's Saber and Tootie together, watching their video and um, and then Saber was just getting a bunch of like, you know, you got Legendary and Exotic and all this good stuff that Tootie was not at all getting. <laughs> so, so, you know, you just have, you can have very big differences in how well things go. So, you can also get, um... Something I'm going to try to go for is, also, okay, I'm going to try to get, okay, balloon trap is obviously good. But I'm trying to find uh, weapons that can make money, because you can have, like, banana farm upgrades in this. And I'm going to see if this ability is affected by that stronger, like, card boost, because it said money boost. Oh, it's actually making me less money? Something must have reduced my money. Wow, eight pierce, sure. Interesting. So yeah, so like I said, something must have reduced my money. Because now it's only 9,000 and Pretty sure normally that ability gives um, 10,000. I'm 
pretty sure. At least I thought it did. Um, it wouldn't make sense to only <laughs> to only give nine thousand. So okay, whatever. I just hope we can uh, get something good. Hot shot, hot rings. I think hot shot would probably be better. If we get another monkey nomics ability, that would be pretty good because you can have like abilities that stack. Just like with weapons, like you can have the weapons stack, you can have the ability stack. See, now we got another spike storm. So spike storm will, we can have, you know, obviously see it triggers twice. Um, so yeah, if we can get another monkey nomics, then that's eighteen thousand dollars, um, pretty quickly. Uh, we got teleportation. Teleportation is an okay upgrade. I'll probably move him there. Have him, have him a little bit closer to the front. And then, yeah, if things ever go awry, then I can move him around. Uh, we got Blade Maelstrom. Things are going very well this time. Um, I, cause, you know, like I said, I did a little bit of testing beforehand and, you know, I, there's a few things that I didn't know about that I do know about now. And, yeah, things, uh, things didn't go too good. <laughs> I, I lost pretty early on. Because I, I couldn't see camo. Um, so, you know, having something that can actually see camo is obviously a very nice addition. Um, oh, that We didn't get the ability, but we got for Spirit of the Forest. So I can't actually be that mad. Uh, wait, does it? So does Spirit of the Forest... No, that usually comes with... That has the ability, right? Uh, the jungle bounty ability, and we didn't get the jungle bounty ability, so... I'm assuming that doesn't come with it. Okay. Spirit of the Forest, forest is still going to be really good, especially on this map. So, I'll, you know, I'm happy. I'm happy. I'll take it. Let's go for large caliber. Because obviously that's going to be a sniper, so can hit anywhere on the map hot shot isn't really gonna be as good i don't think in my opinion anyways so should i try to save up for another ability probably i could love something that you know a bit more uh, spike storm okay and i was hoping for a little something that to make me more money but, I guess we'll get another Psy ability. Ooh, DDTs. I actually did not, they didn't survive for as long as I thought they would. They, they got pretty messed up. Etienne again? Okay, so yeah, so it, and even the... Even the hero abilities can stack, so you can, or uh, hero weapons can stack. So yeah, now we're up to four of Etienne's little drones. Yeah, I mean, this setup is actually really, really good. We have three overdrives. That should probably just start melting this stuff. <laughs> I would assume, at least. Um... Yeah, I mean, let's go for that one. It's supposed to be a money boost. Let's see if that... No, it's still at 9,000. So maybe... Maybe I was wrong. Maybe it's, all... maybe it's always been at um, 9,000 and not 10,000. I don't know. Yeah, it's still just... Still just going with that, so I'm not sure. 
I'm starting to even doubt my own knowledge of this game. Um, get another strong weapon. So reduce the attack speed, but range, pierce damage, and money boost would all go up. Honestly, I'm probably happy with that. The bad got absolutely melted. Um, got another overclock that we really don't need. Okay, okay. Um, I'm liking this, I'm liking this. Tech Terror. Tech Terror is going to be really good. I mean... Oh, oh, okay. Things are getting a little further than I would like them to. Oh, Bomb Blitz? Oh my gosh. Jeez. Yeah, I mean, you guys are going to have to let me know, like, what I should do next. Another Sentry Expert? Two Sentry Experts that are both being overclocked. So, we're just going to have a bunch of these Sentry Turrets. Oh, gosh. Gee, what's another... Another spike storm. Just what I... Just what I wanted. I have like four or five spike storm abilities at this point. I mean, I guess one of them is a carpet of spikes. So, I mean, I can't really actually be that mad. Ooh, destroyer. Okay. I'll probably go... I mean, it, at some point, I'm going to lose, right? Like, at some point in time, like, this setup isn't going to just survive forever, right? Like, at some point, I'm going to lose, I assume. I think I'm going to try to upgrade to the advanced ancient monkey. And, uh, kind of see how that goes. So I am very curious what's going to happen if, when that happens, when, when I get that upgrade. That was a, that was a pretty good, uh, snowstorm ability, if I do say so myself. You know, all, it was all me. I had nothing to do with, uh, the tech bot over there, constantly using the ability. Um, I mean, these bads are just getting melted. Even at 119, it's like, it's, it's like, this guy is just shredding through them. And I mean, the longer the rounds take, the more money I earn, because I'm just constantly earning, earning money from this monkey-nomics uh, ability. So I'm honestly not even, I'm not even upset that it's taking a while, because I can just save up the money and <laughs> you know stall out the rounds allow the money to build up and yeah once once i get this then i'm gonna upgrade to that oh everything res like all the Ooh, okay i didn't realize all this stuff would reset oh and now you get to select you get to oh my gosh Wow. This is... Okay, this might be a little insane. Because, yeah, we're going to be making quite a lot of money now. Sure. Let's just get another spike 
another freaking spike storm because why not let's just get a bunch of elite sniper upgrades as well to have another way of making lots of money we haven't even gotten you know more uh more weapons yet let's go for a first strike go for another no okay go for another carpet of spikes why not I, I, I don't even, at this point, like, oh, another Monkeynomics. Oh. Uh, good triple shot. Go for Psy again. Dragon's Breath, Sharpshooter. See, greater, see, there we go. Now we got... Now we got something that's making money. Go for Bloom Lick of Fire. Go for Psy again. Go for Ballistic Missile. Century Champion. Uh, another Bomb Blitz. Heart of Thunder. Another Bomb Blitz. I'll go for Greater Production again. Plasma Blast, let's go for another ability. I might break the game. Honestly, let's put down a banana farmer. You get another MIB. Literally no point at all of having another MIB, but we could just do it for the sake of doing it. Uh, let's get, uh... Another balloon solver. Then we uh, uh, get another summoning phoenix. Let's get another elite sniper. Oh my gosh! Greater production. Another sentry champion. Should we can start going for stronger upgrades? Sure. Uh, money boost. I think the first thing I want to start looking at is money boost. Yeah, I'm going to start just looking at the money boost see what uh what's the best option okay this guy is things are getting a little out of hand I think Yeah, I think he's gotten to a point where I don't think I can really lose now that I'm looking at this once again. Um, um, I guess I guess reduced attack speed is actually a good thing. Or like the attack speed boost going down, I guess, is a good thing. Which I guess I should have realized. Pierce up by 12. I don't think I quite need that. But did I... Break the game? Oh, never mind. Yeah, let's get some balloon crush. Get some Moab blue while we're at it. Sticky bomb. Another balloon solver. Recursive cluster. Another sentry. You know what? Let's just uh get laser blast. I don't know. Um. 
Things are going, things are not getting as hard as I thought they would be. He's kind of just shredding through everything that's on the screen. Um, depending on how long this takes, I might go until like round 200 and then just call it there. Um, but yeah, I guess we'll we'll see. You know what? We'll go we'll go round 150, and then I'm gonna call it. But I'll definitely have to play this mod again in the future because this is. Yeah, this is pretty insane. This is very much so insane. I, I mean, I wish I could, like, speed things up a little bit faster, but... How much money has he made? He just made us a mil over a million dollars. From the different, like, abilities. The elite sniper ability, obviously, is going to be making us a lot of money. Um... I mean, greater production. We got, we literally got the banana farmer who's collected almost 200,000. Um, so yeah, um, this is ridiculous. This is actually insane. We're gonna turn off auto start and we're just gonna. Like, only bads are even showing up on the screen. But yeah, we're just gonna see what happens. Or I guess I should say, not see what happens. Um, because it's, it's all getting vaporized before our eyes. Up oh, there, up, oh, yep, oh, a bad made it out for a little while. And, uh, now it's gone. And now we have lots of money to collect. You know, who even needs, like, paragons in this game? Like, you don't even need a paragon. You just need the ancient monkey, and he just, he destroys everything. Like, that's all you need. So, yeah, um, if there's anything I've learned from today's video, I would say that this, uh, the ancient monkey is a little bit broken. Um, probably needs a little bit more balancing. But, it's a, it's definitely a fun one. Definitely... Ugh, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, definitely a very fun mod. Um, I, I hope to play more. I'm, I'm definitely going to play more of it, like I said, in the future. And yeah, especially if you guys want to see it. Let me know uh, if there's anything else I should do or any other mods you guys want to see me try or any anything else you want me to try out with this mod. Um, and uh, yeah, my name's Sam. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. It mean the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.